dream of young boys to steal young girls' youth. The clouds, what can I say about the clouds? The stream said something, it must have been abducted. The trees, the obsessional behavior converting dollars to euros, counting over and over and over again. But my sleep, my very sleep, it must have been abducted. The wind abducted. Coal mine, soft beer, salami, coffee, tea, everywhere, McDonald's, forest, trash, big dog, small dog, abducted, nettles and brick and horseshit and toilets, young boys, stealing young girls, youth, pine, pineapple, night balls, night and its balls, must have all been abducted. Thank you. 
I work on something to create something. If it works, I will call it something. Sky without a connection. I visualize it. Counting over and over again. Cables, wires, information. I create it. If it works, I will call it moon, meat, cloud, wall, flavorful, film, craft, illustrator, a long walk, a day. Maybe I will. Right on the spot. 
God, Norman, why are you asking me to sing? All my many personalities spread apart like the wings of birds to check out this scam. And you remember that old song, and it's hard, you know, it ain't easy, it's hard. for that moment that the solo took to happen. Its ambitions there for the moment, before it embarked on its trip to join truth in an ever-expanding universe, clouded with ambition and lies. Sing for a moment. Put me on the spot the way Norman put me on the spot. <laughs> I'm hypnotized, I'm enraged, I'm the same when I'm hurt, 
admire. No practice, practice. I have used the little bits of knowledge and speech that I know, though I know I know the difference, always know the difference. It's a tough one, we'll have to figure it out. <laughs> if we can't figure it out, we'll just throw it away. <laughs> Phil is a good poet because he's witty, intelligent, and famous. He's published in at least three languages. People laugh the minute he gets on stage and opens his mouth. His hard work and efforts have made him so. I'm not really sure if birds ever sing inside his head. The same work as any other <laughs> Will is a good poet because of the color of his skin. Because of the color of his skin, he may or may not promote this fact, but it is a fact nonetheless. He is this. He cannot change it. We cannot change it. I'm sure he must hear birds in his head sometimes. The people out here are at the bottom. No matter where they may appear to be, they're still at the bottom. They abuse the little bits of knowledge and speech they possess. They thrive and survive within this banana republic they have created. Sometimes they hear birds outside their windows. Sometimes they see birds on the sidewalk and trees, in the gutter, on TV, in the movies, in the dirt in their small backyard. And so do I. And so do I. I try not to partake, but I am trapped within the peels of this banana republic nonetheless. Now, Bill is a good poet despite his station in life, despite his wit, his color, his speech, his anger, his habits, his effect on or his being affected by these genes we all have to wear, these tight genes that we wear with such great pain. <laughs> Sometimes he peels those genes away. Sometimes, defiantly, he only thinks he peels them away. He hears birds everywhere. He sees birds everywhere, the way only a poet sees birds, and he lives to tell their story. Me, I'm not a happy the birds that call me out of bad dreams on sleepless mornings, they know this. I see them, I hear them, but never really let them fly into my head, to live inside my head, to visit with me for a while. I know that people will say that these birds I speak of, let's call them my birds, are not very original. But they are. Everyone else's birds came to me way after I started writing these words about my birds. My very birds, these seeds that I didn't even know were planted, suddenly they, my birds, started pecking at the language beneath my forehead, as if behind my skull there hung an abandoned bird feeder or an open palm, with traces of birds feet still sticking on the surface. I gotta tell you something. I fill out forms just like everyone else. People say things, people call names, appointments are broken and kept. Pictures hang on walls. Sometimes these pictures are of birds, sometimes of flowers and mothers and babies and moons over barren landscapes. <laughs> Now, vultures, no one popular, are very good poets. Because they're ugly and they wait for things to die. Pigeons, pigeons are good poets just because they're pigeons. And they are perhaps the most famous and recognized poets of all. So, but I have to ask you, what happened to the robin with its red breast? Did it smoke within the peels of this banana republic while trying to swallow our very last virgin seed?
pictures of smoke on the wall, pictures that tell us what we can and cannot do.